Hi, I'm Ron DeFore. This is a short video highlighting my book, Growing Up in Disneyland, about growing up in a Hollywood celebrity family and my celebrity father, Don DeFore, one of America's beloved stars whose acting career spanned several decades in the golden era of Broadway, movies, and television. Don DeFore earned a star on Hollywood's Walk of Fame for his role as Thorny in The Adventures of Ozzie and Harriet in the early 50s. The Adventures of Ozzie and Harriet, the Nelson's next-door neighbor, Thorny, is played by Don DeFore. Dad also played Mr. B in the 1960s TV series, Hazel. In addition to Don DeFore's starring roles on Broadway, he also co-starred in movies with many Golden Era stars, Spencer Tracy, Charlton Heston, Doris Day, Elizabeth Scott, Gail Storm, Robert Cummings, Rock Hudson, Dean Martin and Jerry Lewis, Bob Hope and Lucille Ball, John Wayne, and many others. Here's a memorable clip from Dad's co-starring role with Ronald Reagan. Now look here, you made her cry and I'm not going to stand for it. What are you going to do besides making this grandstand play for her to hear? <laughs> oh, brother, you've really had too much. You are a cat. A cat? I thought you said I was a sea lion. You are a cat, and I am a blackbird. <laughs> so you're a blackbird. All right, little birdie, fly away and sober up. So my book is unusual. It's a hybrid between an autobiography and a biography. The book's title, Growing Up in Disneyland, is not only a metaphor for my life in a celebrity family, but it is also literal, as Disneyland in Anaheim, California, was the DeFore kids' backyard when Dad owned Don DeFore's Silver Banjo Barbecue Restaurant in Frontierland. That's Dad with his brother Vern, who managed the Silver Banjo. And how about that? A chicken dinner for only $1.75. That's our family riding in Disneyland's opening day parade in the Autopia Cars, July 15th, 1955. And that's me and my sister Dawn riding with Walt Disney himself in a Disneyland Christmas parade. My mom was also an entertainer as the featured vocalist for both the Henry Bussey Orchestra and Art Castle and his Castles in the Air in the late 1930s and early 1940s. She recorded with both orchestras and made I'm a Little Teapot famous. At my parents' wedding, Judy Garland was her matron of honor. My book includes dozens of fascinating, sometimes unbelievable experiences, like getting to meet the Beatles, Led Zeppelin, the Beach Boys, Robin Williams, Jonathan Winters, and Dad, as president of the Television Academy, selling the first national broadcast of the Emmy Awards to NBC in 1954. After many years of sharing my life's adventures with friends, clients, and Disney enthusiast groups like this one with Brother Dave, many had the same comment. You should write a book. And so I have. <laughs> <laughs>